So from faith, we also see that there is talk of justification. Now, and I think it's a helpful way to think of justification as a manner of which that's easy to remember. It's justification is a condition in which we are presented to before God as though we've never sinned. That is, that is the work, again, that comes to us through the work of faith, this justification. Justification is a, is a legal action. It's a legal phrase. Uh, and, and it is one by which that God applied here, that God declares the one who's guilty as innocent. It is as though God puts us in a condition, in a situation before Him as though we've never sinned before. Now we have sinned. We have the markings of sin all over us. Everywhere and everything about us is marked and scarred with sin. But by the work of Christ, and we'll talk about how Christ does this justifying work in just a moment. But this justification is this legal action by which God declares the believer in faith, who's believed in faith, and He's declared him freed from his guilt of sin. He's, he's declared him innocent. And so because of that, there has to be a way in which he does this. This legal action in the in a legal court of action, one would be justified so long as, even though he may be guilty of the charges that are before him, there is a, there is a work of justification that something has to be done. That, that sin, that, that action has to be atoned for. 